to pre-math in this video tutorial we are going to find the area of this given triangle with these given vertices a b and c and here is the formula that we'll be using to find the area of this triangle which is 1 over 2 times this whole box and by the way this box is called the determinant of a 3 by 3 matrix. Once again, this is called the determinant. And let's focus on our these vertices A, B, and C. In this vertex A, we are going to call this coordinate X1, Y1, for B coordinate X2, Y2, and for C coordinate X3, y3 then the the formula for the area of triangle can be written as in terms of point a b and c as you can see so i can write this determinant as these points 5 negative 5 negative 6 4 negative 3 10 and this on the right hand side column are simply ones. And now uh, in our next step, we are going to evaluate this determinant. And you can see I have just wrote down this determinant right up here. And we are going to find the value. Let me show you an easy way to find the value of this determinant. Just simply draw this horizontal line right above this bottom row. Now let's crisscross right now. Let's cross multiply this way. 4 times 5 is 20. Then you put always a minus sign. Negative 5 times negative 6 is 30, positive 30. So that is going to give us negative 10. This negative 10 is going to go in the opposite direction right up here. Let's crisscross the next two columns negative 1 times 5 is negative 5 minus 1 times 4 is 4 so that is going to make a negative 9 that is going to go in the opposite side over here now let's focus on this this column the very first column 5 negative 6 just copy and paste over here and let's crisscross once again. 1 times negative 6 is negative 6 minus 1 times 5 is 5, which is going to make it negative 11. So negative 11 is going to be here. Let's now multiply and then add them. We're going to multiply these numbers first and then we're going to add them. So let's multiply it out. That's going to give us negative 3 times negative 9 is positive 27 and that's going to give us negative 110 and that is going to give us negative 10 and if we add them together if we simplify them that is going to give us negative 93 and now finally we are going to calculate the area of the triangle by just simply multiplying 1 over 2 times we figured out the value of this determinant which is negative 93 and if we simplify it that is going to give us negative 46.5 and we know that the area must always be positive so this quantity become positive so our area turns out to be positive 46.5 square unit and that is our answer and here is your assignment can you do this problem on your own now you can take your time luckily i have already uploaded this video could you go ahead and check it out and see the correct answer? Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.